I'm happy to be back in Maui. This is the windsurfing mecca, so it always feels great to, to be here, to be back. I actually can't believe that I came already so many times here. I remember that just five years ago, it was my dream to come here for the first time, so, so it's, uh, it's unbelievable. Maui, it's so special and uh, it played a huge role in my improvement, both as a windsurfer and as a person. Being able to windsurf every day with the best riders in the world, have them in front of you, you know, uh, seeing them uh, ride every day, at the same time riding such a difficult and powerful wave, and uh, as the place is so consistent, you can windsurf almost every day when you're here. So all these components together make it a really special place and um, it's just perfect for for improving, you know, it's just perfect for improving your windsurfing and it pushed me so much to improve my wave riding and work every day on how, how to get better, how to get a better windsurfer. I would say that I love and I hate at the same time this wave because uh, it's it's Okipa is just a wonderful spot, you know, it's, a, it's the windsurfing mecca, it's a hard spot, like the best riders, uh, you know, they're the best riders and I believe that if you want to be one of the best wave riders in the world, you need to rip Okipa, you know, you need to be really good there. So I love Okipa because uh, actually the conditions are different every day. So that pushes you so much to adapt and and improve and work on your windsurfing you know because everyday conditions are different so every day you gotta adapt and you gotta you gotta ride in a way that you weren't used to so this all this together uh, makes you improve every day and makes you become a better windsurfer and you know at the same time talking about outside of the water uh, coming to Maui it permitted me to get in touch with a completely different culture completely different people and actually, when I came here for the first time, I noticed so much positivity and so much happiness in people. And I was, and I was stoked, you know, I was, I was impressed. So it inspired me and uh, I started working on myself and I started being uh, uh, more positive. And whoa, like till now, it just, it had, it had a huge impact on my life in better, you know, it improved so much in better my life and the way I see things, you know, being positive instead of always so negative. And also, I was so lucky to, to meet like seriously wonderful people, wonderful people. I met, I met what's now my best friend and coach. I met what I call my second family, my Hawaiian family, and many, many other friends that taught me so much uh, gave me so much support and help and uh, and really like are a big part of what I am now and uh, what I achieved and what I'm going for you know so I'm, I'm really grateful for the for the people that I met here and you know the friendships and and the relationships that I that I created here finally as uh, as I'm always aiming to improve both as a windsurfer and as a person it's, it's perfect to come back to Maui, you know, as, as I spend so much time here, that when I come back uh, and have been maybe a few months traveling, I, I come back here and I can measure my improvement, you know. I can, I, can, I can see the differences respect an year ago when I was here or just a few months ago when I was here. So it's, it's really good for me because, yeah, I can measure how I changed as a person, if I improved that aspect that I was working on, and if I improved my windsurfing, if my turns are better, if my wave lecture is better, if I learned these maneuvers. So it's, uh, it's awesome to come back here and reset everything, um, reanalyze how things are going, my improvement level, my improvement rate, and redefine the plan and start working on it again. So yeah, here we are. Let's make this month count. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Let's, let's do it. <laughs>